This is not a, it's definitely not as heavy as, <laughs> as it looks. Very heavy. It's actually very, very heavy. I was changing to a smaller camera to do my videos. And I couldn't find a small camera that could also do photos good enough so I can actually use them for other social media and projects and whatever. But uh, I'm just seeing that I think my level might be a bit high. Hello, hello. I was researching cameras for a while and trying to see which camera might do the trick. Let me just go to where the lighting is better. This thing has auto ISO, so I don't, I don't know how good the auto ISO is. And I'm not gonna hold this, actually. I'm just gonna put it somewhere around here. Do -do -do -do. Ah. Does, that, does that make sense? Let me move this a little bit. That way, or that way. Oh, she's too bright. So, trying to decide what would be the best setup to do the vlogs, but also the product reviews, um, was complicated. It took me like three months researching cameras. I haven't owned a DSLR in like four years, which is crazy to think. I only have this puppy here. So I traded my DSLR years ago for video and it was all going well until I started to realize I don't have a, a steels camera anymore. I wanted a camera and I encountered a few problems. First, I wanted to be 4K, obviously, because I've been shooting in the Ursa for so long. The quality of that camera is just absolutely mad. And I have actually made vlogs with that camera but it's too big and it's probably not practical. Even though I was in denial, I wanted to continue using it, it's not practical. And the lack of autofocus meant that if I was gonna do a shot of myself and someone else was handling the camera, the camera man might not have the shot in focus. So then it just, it didn't work unless it was me shooting or someone experienced using that camera. Uh, generally the shots were not usable, you know. And obviously it was big, more complicated to, to move around, to use, more expensive. So I kind of stopped making the vlogs. I got a GoPro there, or not the GoPro, yeah, I got a GoPro and surfing went inside the water, the GoPro Hero 7. Uh, so that was uh, horrible, so I was sad for a while. And then I decided I needed, no, then I got an Osmo action camera, which I still use for surfing. Amazing camera, love it. I have a drone, so why not go with DJI? DJI is making great products. So I stick, uh, I, you know, I still have that camera and I use it, but sound was an issue. I made a few vlogs uh, going to surf and the sound is just a big issue. So, you know, so I would say sound is, 60 or 70 percent of, of the video uh, and then the visuals are the rest you know so if you don't have good sound then no one would want to watch it unless you're just making a random compilation video with cool music for epidemic sound the rest of the videos do need good sound that's why i'm trying this setup and um, i just got the 60 mark ii why because of the autofocus first the flip screen second and I can put my Rode mic Rode Video Mic Pro Plus very long name Rode Video Mic Pro Plus and the mic I can actually see the histogram level so I can see the mic is picking up the sound I hope it's a it's good quality it's not like the long road I had in the Ursa but it, it will do because it's light and I also got a uh, Gorilla pod, jib thing, whatever, which makes it easier to put the camera in different positions and continue to vlog with both of my hands free. So I can do cool things with my hands 
uh, which I couldn't do before. I'm just rambling around, but this is just a test. It's the first time I've turned the camera on and it's the first video I'm making. So there's a lot of reviews coming to the channel. Uh, I have with me the Sigma FP with a bunch of crazy lenses, 85 1.4, no, 35 1.4, 85 1.8, and uh, 14 to 24, uh, 2.8 I believe. But anyhow, Sigma uh, FP, mad camera, big sensor into a very small body. I'll actually show it to you. This is a full frame camera. It's just focusing the camera, not in my face. Okay. This is a full frame camera. It's absolutely mad. So I'm working in those reviews at the moment. It will be a while before I post the videos. Focus on the camera, not on me. Focus on the camera, not in my face. Yeah, there you go. Look at the size of that sensor. Boom. So it will be a few weeks before I have anything concrete about this. I'm still trying it out. Uh, trying photography and trying a few kind of set up with videos and I just finished doing the product shots uh, in the setup I have right now you can't see because it's behind you and hopefully I'll have it all ready uh, in the next couple of weeks there's a bunch of videos coming up so I'm very excited that now I can make more videos more work for myself but anyhow thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video